Hey there, tech enthusiasts. Welcome back to my channel. I'm AS Sharp Dev and today we're diving into the fascinating world of C Sharp interfaces. If you're new here, make sure to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so you never miss an update. Now, you might be wondering, what exactly is an interface and why should you care? Well, an interface in C Sharp is like a contract that defines a set of methods and properties without implementing them. This allows different classes to implement the same set of functionalities in their own unique ways. Let's explore this with some cool examples. Let's start with a simple analogy. Imagine you're building a smart home system. You have different devices like smart lights, thermostats, and security cameras. Each of these devices needs to be controlled, but the way you control them might be different. This is where interfaces come in handy. Let's create an interface called iDevice. This interface will have two methods, turn on and turn off. Now, let's implement this interface in our smart light class. And similarly, we can implement it in our thermostat class. Now, we can control these devices using the same interface, even though they might perform different actions. Let's see how this works in action. We'll create a list of iDevice and add instances of smart light and thermostat to it. When we run this code, both the smart light and thermostat will be turned on and off using the same interface methods. This is the power of interfaces, they provide a way to use different objects through a common interface, making your code more flexible and easier to maintain. But that's not all. Interfaces also help in achieving multiple inheritance in C-sharp. Since C-sharp does not support multiple inheritance with classes, interfaces allow a class to inherit from multiple sources. For example, let's say we have another interface I connected device with a method connect to Wi-Fi. Now, our smart light can implement both iDevice and iConnected device. This makes our smart light both a device and a connected device, enabling it to perform additional functionalities. Interfaces are incredibly powerful and versatile. They help you design clean, modular, and scalable code. So next time you're designing a system, think about how interfaces can make your code more flexible and easier to manage. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know in the comments how you use interfaces in your projects or if you have any questions. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.